China has made considerable efforts to defeat U.S. stealth aircraft such as the B-21. While strategic bombers have been the long arm of U.S. air power during the 20th and early 21st centuries, technological advances may force a rethink of stealth bombers' role in increasingly transparent aerial battlefields. The B-21 Raider, unveiled by Northrop Grumman in December 2022, marks the first new strategic bomber in decades. Featuring advanced stealth technology, digital engineering, and multifunctional capabilities, it is capable of delivering both nuclear and conventional payloads. The U.S. Air Force aims to procure over 100 B-21s, making it more cost-effective than the B-2. The B-21 will play a crucial role in countering peer threats like China and Russia. The radar was developed to be the multifunctional backbone of the modernized bomber fleet, gradually replacing the aging Rockwell B-1 Lancer and B-2 Spirit bombers now in service. A dual-capable penetrating strike stealth aircraft, the B-21 will be capable of delivering both conventional and nuclear munitions. While the U.S. mulls acquiring more of its next-generation B-21 bombers, fast-moving technological advancements could make the type obsolete upon delivery. While strategic bombers have been the long arm of U.S. air power during the 20th and early 21st centuries, technological advances may force a rethink of stealth bombers' role in increasingly transparent aerial battlefields. China has made considerable efforts to defeat U.S. stealth aircraft such as the B-21. The U.S. Air Force is exploring options to supplement or replace B-21 production, while also planning to fly updated B-52s equipped with the Rapid Dragon palletized munition system. As an inexpensive means of creating long-lasting, low-complexity standoff strike platforms. It is also considering buying all 100 B-21s despite cost issues, which are coming down after negotiations with Northrop Grumman. However, the threat environment that informed the B-21's design a decade ago has significantly changed. The B-21 is a member of the long-range standoff LRSO family of systems, and can be used for future variations or derivatives along with the AGM-181 ALRSO stealthy nuclear-armed cruise missile and other advanced systems such as munitions, sensors, electronic warfare packages and communication systems. However, the Warzone says that acquiring additional B-21s contradicts evolving trends in aircraft procurement and capabilities. The bomber mission is changing due to survivability demands, evolving integrated air defense networks and longer range and more capable counter-air munitions. It also states the importance of using cost-effective, quickly designed and readily deployable standoff systems is increasing on the battlefield. At the same time, the B-21st the of May be the last new U.S. Air Force bomber. While strategic bombers have been the long arm of U.S. air power during the 20th and early 21st centuries, technological advances may force a rethink of stealth bombers' role in increasingly transparent aerial battlefields. China has made considerable efforts to defeat U.S. stealth aircraft such as the B-21, leveraging AI and more advanced sensors. In December 2023, Asia Times reported that China had simulated shooting down a B-21 using new stealth aircraft, advanced radars and hypersonic missiles. The simulation showcased new technologies, such as stealth aircraft with conformal skin that detects heat and electric signals, unmanned wingman drones and hypersonic missiles with adjustable solid fuel pulse engines. It also emphasized the potential of AI in air-to-air -air combat, with decision-making shifting rapidly between pilots, drones and missiles. In addition, China has reportedly developed a small and discreet anti-stealth radar that can be quickly and quietly placed on rooftops. Contrasting with traditional systems that need large antennas to detect stealth aircraft. Chinese engineers have also reportedly designed a compact infrared search and track IRST system based on medium-wave infrared technology capable of detecting the signature of fast-moving aircraft from considerable distances. The device can identify the aircraft's outline, rotors, tail and number of engines from the infrared spectrum image. Furthermore, the South China Morning Post SCMP reported this month that Chinese researchers have developed a method to increase an F-22's radar signature up to 60,000 times using multiple radars and smart resource scheduling. 
The South China Morning Post SCMP says the technology allows a centralized networking radar system to enhance the intensity and tracking accuracy of radar signature and save valuable resources. For handling other targets by adjusting beam parameters and the power of each radar based on characteristics and real-time positional changes of stealth aircraft. Achieving comprehensive tracking of F-22 fighters with just three radars. The SCMP report says the information can be rapidly transmitted to interceptor fighters or SAM batteries, enabling prompt F-22 fighter intrusions. It notes precise calculations for target coordinates and movement speeds that can reportedly be completed in 0.02 seconds. SCMP says these radars can be strategically positioned on land, islands, ships and aerial platforms, bolstering China's anti-access area denial A2AD in the South China Sea and Western Pacific regions. As noted, the B-21 features a similar flying wing design to the B-2 Spirit. The radar embodies decades of advances in stealth technologies, which are expected to have far outpaced advances in defensive systems. This is essential to winning a war with China. Many of the People's Republic of China PRC's high-priority targets are deep inside Chinese territory and protected by advanced air defenses. In an August 2022 Air University article, Mel D'Elia mentions that stealth technology in aircraft has advanced since 2001, emphasizing the importance of bombing tactics that leverage low observable characteristics. D'Elia also expounds on the role of the bomber over the past 30 years, noting the shift from multiple bombers attacking a single target to one bomber hitting multiple targets with precision. However, he points out that China's growing air power poses a challenge to US strategic bombing capabilities. Noting that the People's Liberation Army Air Force PLA Air Force is the third largest air force in the world. As of October 2023, the PLA Air Fork has 1,900 fighters and has operationally fielded its J-20 stealth fighter, whose numbers are expected to grow in the coming years. Dialya also points out that China has a robust and redundant integrated air defense system IADS. Operating radars, fighters and surface-to-air missile SAM systems that can reach up to 300 nautical miles offshore to defend against an impending attack. While strategic bombers have been the long arm of US air power during the 20th and early 21st centuries, technological advances may force a rethink of stealth bombers' role in increasingly transparent aerial battlefields.